This is a member of the grasshopper order. The family is Stamopelmatidae. This little critter lives underground, moist areas. He's a good digger. Eats roots mostly. An occasional insect that gets in the way becomes part of the protein, part of the diet. Has strong mandibles for chewing roots mostly. Long skinny antennae. Little insignificant compound eyes. Doesn't have good vision at night. Doesn't need it. Strong legs, strong attitude. Some cultures call it the bald-headed little old man. Those mandibles can bite a finger. He's a feisty fellow. He doesn't like me holding on to his hind leg with a pair of tweezers. But this is his photographic debut and we want him to look really handsome which he really is beautiful. Some cultures deify this little critter. It's good luck. Other cultures think it's bad luck to come upon a Jerusalem cricket. This critter is common in the southwestern U.S. and into Mexico and Baja. Found in cool, damp places underground. They dig in the dirt very well. Eats roots mainly. They don't like potatoes any more than they like other roots. It's got great claws, mostly for digging. On his rear end are little structures, sensitive. They're called Circe. Looks like a big ant, but not related to ants. Related to grasshoppers, crickets, katydids. This little critter is without wings. Doesn't jump like a grasshopper, but does have very strong hind legs. His little mandibles, under the right conditions, can cause quite a pinch. They're more interested, however, in running away than staying to fight. He's out of here. I'm going to release these tweezers. And he's going to go look for a place underground. Here he is, on his way. The end.